Yes, them of the art of a pagan The children of the art of a lion I know He will move with Satan Righteous trod in the countenance of the Almighty One Them of the art of demons The children of the art of a lion I know He will move with Satan Righteous walk in the countenance of the Almighty One Good people see hostility rising daily Black football player, and they took another Negro, Jason Collins, who's an openly gay black basketball player. Just signed to the Brooklyn Nets, the Brokeback Nets. That's their name. That should be their name, the Brokeback Nets. You understand? That's what happens when you integrate and you vote and you try to love America. That's what happened, man. That's what happened to our people, man. Okay? Let me get Leviticus 20 and 26. That's what happened when we do all those things, man. We ain't supposed to be loving this place, man. The brother brought out about the Harlem Globe Trotters. Look at Harlem now. Harlem is white right now. Harlem used to be black. Don't come up here with that garbage and talk about love everybody. When the white man and gentrify your black communities. So is DC. DC used to be known as Chocolate City. Now look, they pushing you out of DC now. They building condos and moving and raising raising the price of living, and you got to get out of DC now. That's hey, hey, right. hey, Dad, that's right. Like the captain said, is that the change you wanted? Right. That's the change you voted for. You see that? That's what happened, man. And not only gentrification, but gentrification. He telling you a man can be a woman. Right. He gonna gentrify you now. Not only gentrify, but gentrify. <laughs> yeah, you right. You damn right, brother. You wrong. It's a crying shame. Go ahead, brother. Right. Twenty twenty. Leviticus chapter twenty, verse twenty six. And you shall be holy unto me. What did the Lord say when He said be holy? Holy means to be separated. The Lord said you shall be holy unto me. The word holy means to be separated. Go ahead or segregated, shall I say? Uh, maybe that'll ring a bell. Segregated. Go ahead. For I, the Lord, am holy. The Lord is holy. The Lord ain't all these gods that you that you praying to. He ain't Buddha. He ain't Allah. He ain't the, the, the white man's currency. He ain't all these things. And he ain't down with all the nations. He a holy God, man. He's separate. Right. He's separate. Go ahead. And have seven deep. And have what? And have seven you. How, how many of y'all know what it means to be seven? If you seven something. What does that mean? That means to segregate. That means and, and that means to divide something, man. He has he has severed you. Listen clearly. For all, all, everybody that say they want to come together with everybody, the Lord said, I have severed you. Go ahead. From other people. From who? Other people. Join everybody. Severed you from other people. This is in the Bible right here. This is in the Bible right here. So what, what did Christians say when Christ said he come and love everybody, bring everybody together? The Lord said he severed us. Why did he sever us? He severed you for a reason. He severed you for your own benefit. He severed you. Why? Because he knew if you were to join another race of people, that race of people would be over you. Just like today in America. Just like with your sports. It's still the Negro leagues. Ain't nothing but Negroes playing. But who getting the money? Who get the money off the heart of Globe Trotters? It's still a Negro League right around, brother. That's true. But they collecting the money now. That's what happened. The only thing they integrated was your money in their pockets. You understand? That's the integration that they can happen. Go ahead. That ye should be mine. A man. Okay, drop that. Take me to uh, take me to Deuteronomy 7 and 3. You understand? We vote in this place, vote for all these things, vote for equality. You don't vote for no damn equality. You understand? First and foremost, who is he to be equal to anyway? What does that say about you? And you gotta fight to be equal with him. That's saying you beneath him already. Right. That's saying you got low self-esteem already. I don't see the Chinese trying to be equal with the white man. The Chinese got a Chinatown and they communists. They didn't fight for civil rights. Right. They didn't fight to get voting rights. But they got a town they own in every major city in America. Making money. 
and they sending it back to China for nuclear missiles. That's true. You understand? Yeah, they got true. they got stores in your ghettos. Yes, they do. Selling you food. Yeah. Sending their kids to Georgetown off of ten thousand dollars of your money. Oh, yeah. And they can't even speak English. They talk about their Hispanic brothers can't speak English. They never say the Chinese can't speak English. The Chinese come over here, they don't have to learn English. You know why? Because they got unity. They got a nation of their own. You understand? Go ahead, brother. Deuteronomy 7 and 3. Neither shall thou make marriages with them. We are not supposed to make marriages with these people, man. You understand? You can't have a strong nation if you keep giving love outside of that nation. The Lord wants us to marry, marry our own people, man. You got 12 tribes to choose from. You're not supposed to be having interracial marriages with these people. And that's something you so-called Negro athletes like to do anyway. RG3, OJ Simpson, right. Tiger Woods. Now look at the result of it. Now that money went right back to the white man. Right, man, no, he hurt. He's still trying to That's right. He's still trying to do it. There you go. It ain't going to be too long, no. That's right. It ain't gonna be too long for he end up getting jammed up, and that white girl leave him. That white girl leave him after he get jammed up. You better look at look at this black man. You better examine your your community. You better start examining your nation. You understand? Stop believing whatever America tell you to believe. You understand? It's a lot of America ain't telling you. That's why the white man is upset with his own damn government. He mad with the NSA, the FBI, the CIA. Right. These Negroes happy about every damn thing. That's right. The white man is saying that he's not free in his own damn country. Well, somehow you Negroes free. Somehow the black man, you free though. Right. When the white man say he's not free in his own damn country. And this his country. And you ain't upset about a damn thing. Can you imagine that? You understand? According to the American Constitution, you three-fifths of a man. You know that? According to them, thank you, brother. Grab a fly at the table. We got flies at the table, brother. You understand? You three fifths of a man, according to the American Constitution. So you gon' you gon' be on be your life up for that? You supposed to come back to the Lord, man. You special, black man. You know what I'm saying? Our young brothers are special, man. Our young sisters are special, man. It's a war on young black men, man. That's right. You royalty, black man. That's right. You special, man. That's why so much attack on black men. We got rules to follow black men. You understand? It's an attack on our young brothers, man. With that stand your ground in Florida. You, you, go, you go below the Mason Dixon line, it's damn near open season on black men. Damn near right. at DC too. Right. Because guess what? That stand your ground law meaning a white man without a badge and a gun can gun you down in the street if he feel threatened. They just killed the brother in Florida over live music because he said the music was live and he was threatened. You understand? But don't worry though, in a minute you're going to wake up in a minute. Just keep, just keep living. Go ahead, brother. Thy daughter thou shalt not give unto his son, nor his daughter shalt thou take unto thy son. That, that, that's going against what Martin Luther King thought. That's going against Martin Luther King's dream. Because the Lord said, you ain't supposed to give your daughter to his son, you need to take his daughter to your son. That's separation right there. That is segregation. Segregation made our people stronger. Because why? We had to rely on each other. We couldn't go to the white man's restaurant. You understand? So we had to love each other. We had to fix our own damn problems. We had our own restaurant. You understand? Now you can damn near count the number of black businesses on one hand in the ghetto. Everything else is Chinese and Arab. You understand? You ain't got no more businesses, man. You got no more infrastructure. You know why? Because you sold it out with that dream. That dream of Martin the King, man. Okay? Drop that. Take me to uh, Isaiah 32 and 5. Isaiah 32 and 5, man. You gotta understand what time it is, man. Learn what team you are, black man. Learn who, learn who your nation is. Learn who you're supposed to love, who you're not supposed to love. It's gonna save your life, especially in these times, man. America, thank you, brother. America's getting ready to get cut off. You understand? Resources are about to be scarce in this place. And you ain't gonna be able to depend on the white man and his government to help you. You better come join your people. You understand? Go ahead. Isaiah 32 and 5, the vile person 
shall no more be called liberal. The vile person shall no more be called liberal, like the Democrats, the Christians. You understand? They ain't gonna be no more called liberal. Go ahead. Nor the churl said to be bountiful, for the vile person will speak villainy. The vile, that's what happened in America. The vile person is speaking villainy. You can be a homosexual, that's vile. That's what the Christian church say. When you say you can be a homosexual, that's, that ain't what the Lord say. So now they put the law on the back burner now. It's not about what the Lord say. It's about what you want. And when you do that, every time a, 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 a empire or a government did that, the Lord destroyed it. Every time. It happened Rome. It happened Greece. It happened Sodom and Gomorrah. It happened Egypt. That's what happens. Okay, drop that. Take me to, uh, take me to 1 John 2 and 15. 1 John 2 and 15, man. The black colleges is destroyed in America. You understand like the captain brought up. Why? Because guess what? We the integrated now. Now nothing matters about, it ain't about being black no more. It's about being gay. Gay is the new black. That's what I'm hearing. Yeah. That's what hell. I, oh, say what? Say it again, brother. Hell. That's what we need. Yeah. We need some black men to say, hell no. Hell. Damn right, brother. That's what we need. We, the Lord looking for soldiers back here, brother. That's right. That's what you supposed to say, hell no. Yes, they might be a tough a pagan The children of the heart of a lion I know He will move with Satan Righteous trod in the countenance of the Almighty One They might be a tough demon The children of the heart of a lion I know He will move with Satan Righteous walk in the countenance of the Almighty One Good people see hostility rising daily Ignorant multiply brutality We I see that they run gone left mommy If you struggle they are the road with fight beginning Oh I see baby having baby Nothing that happened